Red Pill Pastor, talk to me. So I think you have a misconception of me. Like, I actually okay. like 70% of the things that you say. I'm with you on 70%. Okay. Here's my biggest complaint is that it's not dual sided. We're not approaching it from a full, as much as the red pill is talking about the things that they're saying, and they're not talking about bad male nature, mm -hmm. the church is also not talking about bad female nature. And that, that, that clip that I highlighted from Pastor Joel Webin, he's pointing out in that clip, if you actually listen to the whole thing, he says, the modern church is not talking about the female sins in, 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 in society. They're not addressing promiscuity. When we think of promiscuity or sins, we're looking at it from a male-led standpoint. That's what he was pointing out, and that's what I'm saying. In most evangelical churches today, when we think about sinful nature, we think about sinful nature from a male perspective that men are doing something bad. or not. We don't think that women do something bad because we hear that it's <clears throat> preached predominantly from a male sinful nature standpoint. That could either be because the pastor himself is male, so he's speaking about maybe his own experiences, but it's still not equal in the sense that if we're going to address sinful nature, let's address it across the board. Okay. That's are what you, I'm saying. Uh, are you familiar with the hasty generalization fallacy, what that is? Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. I'm, so I'm, there's, I'm, there's, I'm, there's, there's women in here right now in the chat telling you growing up, they always preached on the girls. Pints with Aquinas, and, who's one of the biggest Catholic YouTubers, did a whole spiel about how women shouldn't wear leggings yeah i don't know wait, wait, i don't know wait, where wait, you're, you're pulling this from so it's like to say that like no one is addressing women stuff, no no, I mean, no i'm not saying I think, no one's addressing it i'm saying they're okay. not addressing it equally that there's a well, difference there's a difference between addressing it and addressing it equally so so I, i'll say my brother hey what's good john keith um I, I i've john seen i appreciate, uh, appreciate it yeah i've seen actually the majority of my i mean i've been in the church my whole life in and out of different churches and all that kind of stuff. My family, my my dad is, you know what I'm saying, been Christian since I, I was born into into a religious family, right? And then found Jesus when I was 17, but been in church all throughout that, before that. The overwhelming majority of what I've seen has actually been very female directed. And I would actually say that that is the exact reason that nowadays we have the whole like feminist movement of like, you know what I'm saying? Oh, purity you, culture. Purity culture. Yeah. Oh, church. Um, they're they they look at women like this, and and we're shamed for wearing certain things, like all all this kind of stuff. What about, that, the, that what about the Lutheran pastor who told girls to melt down their purity rings and made a statue of a vagina and gave it to uh, what's her Mike, name? We're, we're not wait, wait, we're not Mike, Lutheran, dude. My no, 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 I'm, I don't, I'm not. I'm not saying this. I'm saying mainstream. This is the mainstream. Most people don't go to Calvary Chapel. Most people don't see things that, you know, that good foundational churches have, right? Okay, they so you're talking, about, oh, the, you're, you're talking about the main line that's shrinking yes, and that's hemorrhaging numbers. Okay, two yes, totally right different then, conversations. You're talking about the main line. I would, I would say the main line went goober progressive decades ago. They went modernist decades ago. Is, Everyone left those churches. N not these mega ones. What I'm saying is you have name, a great platform. Name, me a, great mega, platform. name me a mainline mega church that does this by, by 2,000 or more members. Mainline mega churches almost don't exist. Uh, I, would say, I, would, I would say Michael Todd's church is pretty mainline. And they're, and you got to admit, they're kind of suspect on a lot of the things that they think. Yeah, but my, Michael, no one really, we don't really you don't know Joel Osteen I mean, or Michael Todd seriously like that. But somebody does because they obviously got viewers. Yeah, and, and, and by the way, and, and, and by the way, the people who the people hold on, hold on, let me finish my thought. The people who take issue with Michael Todd say that he's pushing purity culture. Like the God is great. The super progressive folks are, are like Michael Todd is oppressive to women and he's pr pushing purity culture. Like that's the narrative from folks outside of that ecosystem. But also some people will say he's also pushing the trans culture too, saying like when he was like, I would have asked God, you know, sure, maybe sure, a sure, third sure. option, right? You know yep. what I'm saying? And like, I and I and I said how goofy that was. And I and I, oh, I yeah. duked how goofy that was. So, well, so what you, I'm so, saying, okay. like you have a great yeah. platform, dude. Like it's I I am a fan. Like don't think I'm a hater. I don't think I'm you're a hater. Fan. I I I don't know if your clipping of what I was responding to was accurate, and I don't know if you did that when intentionally was, or in a no, disingenuous what I was fashion. No, was to show because like I tried to talk to you before, and I was like, I agree with what you're saying, man. I love Titus. I love Timothy. Like I love the verses that you reference, but mm -hmm. there's the other side to it 
that also goes towards the women. You know, and like, I cover that too, though. But I just, but I just you don't did cover a woman. It the same though. There's I not do. The same. I'm telling you, There's I do. The same. No, no, bro, come on. When you like, when Rolo comes out, when Rolo says something okay, about hold on, hold on, no, 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 no. Let's 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 talk about my content, and then I'll yeah. give you my thoughts on Rolo. My content. I just did a video about women hitting their hoe phase as they're married. I had a I had a I had a woman on, and we yeah. and we equally rebuked that. That just came out yesterday. We we did a video about women racking up body counts. We did a video about women thinking they're virgins because they still have oral. We did multiple videos about thotty women and which kind you should stay away from i, I have no you, issue with locking arms on rollo or or fresh and fit saying stay but, away from these but, types but, of windows what i'm asking you do you think you do this do you put the same amount of content out for for women that you do for men i would well, say come at it at a balanced approach like if you're gonna do one on ooh, guys and red ooh, pill then just be ooh. like do equal i do i come at them but when i do my videos i come at wait, them wait, both wait. equal Wait, wait, I wait, come wait. out dudes let, come out let, let john talk here, here's john the thing talk. here's the thing i i'm a i'm a me personally i think that I think it's actually it's it's good and it makes more sense if it if it's not even 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 if you like if you say it is you're saying great if it's not even if you're making more videos and talking more about men that makes mm -hmm. sense because you're a man you have experience right. as a man right. speaking to men it, 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 it's a it's Let almost like a wait, wait 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 there there it's almost like a there's not a lot of like self-awareness to be like oh men need to stand up and tell women what they're doing wrong no that's that's not that, that that's not how that how that works you know what i'm saying like that's like sure you. you're saying you can definitely point out sins but it to be frustrated that a man is talking more so about what men are doing wrong is very yeah that's very that doesn't, confusing that doesn't make any sense it's not very coherent hey you want to see something kind of crazy over 75 percent of the people that watch this channel are not subscribe please consider subscribing and turning your bell notification on so that you don't miss anything we have going here when, when you preach or when you're i don't mind calling you a preacher but when you're preaching and you're speaking and you're referencing the bible sure you are sure. preaching you are you're doing a form of preaching okay as being a preaching or using the bible the bible gives us the authority to speak to issues of sin of both men and women we don't have to have uh just just to do women alone I, I didn't say I do just women alone. Um, no, no, no. I'm just saying, but like, I'm not saying you are, but what, what John is saying is like, well, it's okay if he's just doing men, majority of men. Well, no, I come at both men and okay, women so, equally. So let me, I come let me, at let me, equally. Let me, let me, I, I understand, like I, I understand what you do. I understand what you do. Yeah. Let me break, let me, let me help you understand what I'm doing. My audience is like 75% men. The overwhelming mm -hmm. majority of my audience is men. Mm -hmm. I am a man. And I believe men are the identify head. Identify as one too. I'm just kidding identify you. as one too. I am a man. I lead. Mm -hmm. I speak to primarily men. I believe men are the leaders and the and the head. And I don't see a ton of value of making content exclusively or predominantly or equally dunking on goofy women. It's when, not dunking. I would say it's it, more. It, it is. No, 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 no. Even, even Here, correcting, even it, coming it, at, even it, coming out or correcting. Here's the thing: Do you think? Do you think women watch Fresh and Fit? What percentage do you think of of their channel? YouTube splits seventy five percent men yeah. across the board. What yeah. percentage do you think of Fresh? Like, who do you think is watching Fresh and Fit or watching Rolo? You well, think I, it's I don't women? even I, I don't watch Fresh and Fit. So okay, so who do you, you think know, is watching Rolo? I, well, I know that majority of men, but you know what? There is a lot of women that are in there too. I okay, know a so lot of what what benefit is it I for me? Let me let me finish my thought. Let, okay, twenty percent. I think I think it's substantially less than that. But what benefit is it for me to speak to predominantly men and then expose equally 50-50 goofy women behavior? Like like how does that serve men outside of creating another feedback loop for them to hear nasty things about women they should stay away from that they're already hearing from the red pill community? This is where I look at it. The church is no longer a building. And we've already known that. You and I know that the body of never, is the church is the people. So anytime you are speaking on a platform, like what you're doing right now, you're having church, in my opinion. This is church. Uh, no, uh, not, I don't not think even, so. No, not, the church not, is, not, I mean, not what, the, not what you're, the scriptural definition of church you're, is. If no. you're using scripture and you're evangelizing, you are evangelizing when you're talking about God and you are sharing the gospel with people. Uh, I think that's, you're reaching. You're that's, that's, if you're re if you're referencing the scriptures, you are evangelizing in a I, sense. I'm not yes, going to say not, it. I don't have a church though. That's he's a not, stretch. He's not. He's not. He's not having church. He's not a pastor. You have to define what church is. Gathered, Christ is with us. 
Yeah, that's the guy says with us, but that's not that's a not, church. That's not what church is. Not, not to the de definitive definition, but it's a form of church. So it's you a community say, of believers. Yeah, it's maybe yes. it's a part of the capital C church. Yes, yes. The global church, but it's not yeah. a local assembly. No, it's not, not a local, local gathering. No. Okay. But you are ministering. You have an opportunity to minister to both men and women and whoever might be watching. Sure. So why wouldn't you want to address both sides? So, so here, here's the, the part that's interesting to me. I'm almost... So do you think that if a woman, if you think that if Ruslan was a woman, do you think you mm -hmm. would have the same amount of frustration about him preaching or, or uh, talking primarily to women? I, you know, I, you know, I won't say I won't say frustration. Do you think you would have the same amount of, you know, problem with him talking primarily to women if he, if yeah. he was a woman? Yes, I've actually done that. I've come at other women wow. who are just talking about women's sins and not actually bringing out sins for men. So th it's that a that that's complete that's that's i mean first of all props but i think that's very interesting i think that i don't think that there's any anything wrong with hey men speak to men women speak i don't to agree women. i don't have a problem with that either but see that's not the thing that the issue is here because when people are looking at for faith right now and this is just people out here in the youtube space or in the streets they're looking for the artists, especially hip hop artists that they could attract. They're attracted to you, John. They're attracted to Ruslan. They want to hear what you guys are saying, both men and women. So yes. why not yeah. talk to and both I, men I, and women about I, I the do. I do. I do. I'm, I'm not going to make 50% of my bro, content to that. But that doesn't make any sense. So look, he is... <laughs> wait, 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 wait. So look, let's say there's, there's, 70, there's 70 men that watch the stream. And then uh -huh. there's 30 women that watch the stream. Yeah, and he says seventy things about men and thirty mm -hmm. things about women. That doesn't seem that doesn't seem like good math. <laughs> no, I would just come out at fifty fifty. How if there's not fifty there's women? There's not there's thirty 50 women here, man. How do you know that there's even fifty women or seventy women or se no, no, seventy? No, 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 no. Because he said the he analytics. Said it's, We're talking about the analytics. analytics of it that. is you know, that's analytics. You don't know every moment in the moment. Look, just look here. Like this is what I would do. Can I can I give you an example? All right. Break it down for me, Playboy. All right. So everybody's like, oh, the body count thing. You know, Myron said that, you know, you should be able to have like 50 bodies before you get married. Uh -huh. Right. I think it's yeah, ridiculous. That's, that's ridiculous. Yeah, that's poison. That's poison. That's it's poison. poison. Exactly. The Bible says not to. Okay. That's fornication. That's that, you know, it's just that's just bad all the way around. So uh -huh. what does the Bible say? Get together, you know, get married Two become one. Let no man mm -hmm. tear them apart. Right. Amen. Beautiful. Amen. That, that's what I'm with. But when I see guys coming out like, oh, yeah, I need them to spin plates. Sure, you could spin plates but not have sex with them. That means you could get to know women on a personal, intellectual level. Sure. Maybe go on a few dates with them. Sure. You don't have nothing nothing to do with sex. That's spinning plates. I'm good with that. I'm not, you know? I, I, I never said I wasn't good with that. My con competition no, with Rolo I'm, I'm giving, was specifically. I'm giving you my example okay. of like, coming out with. So when I hear women say like, oh, I can, no, 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 girl, stay pure. Your value is there. God, you are valuable, and you lower okay. your value when you if you go hoe out. Don't do that. Don't and, be a and three the, or four. And, and the same is true for men. Exactly. And I'll say this: like scientifically, although from the science standpoint, it may say that it may affect women more detrimentally. That doesn't mean it doesn't affect men detrimentally. So it's still yes. a sin. Yes, it's still a sin. So don't go the Myron way, okay? But understand, yes, guys need to have more understanding on how women nature is but do it from a, a so, biblical way of spinning plates casually dating so, socially interacting without the sexual aspect can right. you so can you say agree to that sure i mean yeah I, I i don't i don't have any any kind of issue with any of that i mean i don't think ruslan does either i think that the, yeah, that would be my the, approach to the conversation is what i'm saying right Instead right, right. but i'm saying on one side. That, that is that is what what's happening that is what that is what's happening but i'm saying so you have that right you have to look at all of the things that are going on at the same time it's like okay, a ruslan is a man b there's largely a man audience watching c he believes men is the a man is the head of the household all of these things together equals yes i'm gonna talk more so to the men watching this because there's more men watching this and i'm also going to talk to the women just not as much because I'm not a I'm not a woman. There's not as many women watching this, and ultimately, a lot of responsibility lands on a man leading a woman. Correct? 
Yes, but you have to ask yourself, are women willing to let men lead today? And that's yes. the other part of the church. It's not, no, no, let me finish. They are. They, they are some, but you have, when you have churches like the Lutheran church, and I'm not, I'm not talking about your church or anybody's church, but I'm talking about the publicized church telling women to go ahead and melt their purity rings, to go ahead and, you know, it's okay. You could be, you could be the woman at the well and, Je and Jesus is, you know what I'm saying? When you got when you got people pushing that agenda, it conflicts with the message. Say, say, brother, the, here, the, you know what I'm saying. The thing, there's always gonna be people saying other messages. We but can't, you, we, we can't, it, we can't it, stop that. We could call that out. It, there's gatekeeping that should be done. Hey, this is a segment from our daily after party stream. Consider partnering with us online for as little as five dollars a month to get access to these daily after party streams completely unedited. You'll also get access to our podcast as they are streamed live into the community before anyone else gets to see them, get to interact with our guests, get access to our private Discord server, and a discount code for our store for as little as $5 a month. Ultimately, that will help towards helping us continue contextualizing the gospel using media and podcast here on YouTube. All right, I'll see you over there. Peace.